who's in the bed with you? You got another mother in this bed? I'm out here slaving away. Is it a dog? What is it? A dog? And he's back! It's a dog! Ha, I get it. Who is it? Why would you just pop off you? Don't come ask one ass in the world. Because I was trying to find the pie. I ain't shit too. Because I was trying to get it. Stop playing. You gotta get over here. Got me. Got me. I feel like rather than film, I would just call the cops. Just straight up call the cops. Cause not only are you potentially in danger, but it looks like the two of them are potentially in danger of each other. So I would just call the cops. Be like, I'm hiding in a closet. I didn't realize the guy had a girlfriend or boy, whatever's going on. And that's it. Wow, he caught her on camera at work. I think he was, they all worked together. I don't know if he was working too or if he was just like spying on her. It's a little weird, but <sighs> that's not good. <sighs> 5.20 in the a.m. My wife left yesterday at 7.30 in the morning to work and did not arrive till now. Good morning, sunshine. 5.20 a.m. It's 5.20 a.m. Nobody's seen you in 24 hours. You see that YouTube? She locked the door. Yep, she's drunk, hungover, locking the door. Has not been seen in 24 hours. Does not care about her children, does not care about her husband. Open the cheats on his husband. But this is what the courts, that cat happens to be a better mother. The cat's a better mother. That's actually just heartbreaking. Like I hate stuff like that, man. I just hate like stuff that just, I don't know. I, I don't like cheaters in general, so it's, yeah. I just caught my ex cheating. I told her to come over, so let's see how this goes. So why were you at Colby's house last night? No. No, stop. It's always the, turn the camera off, stop. I don't know why I would want to film it. I don't know though, cause like my friends are also pretty sick. I feel like maybe if my friends and I, like any of us were in a relationship and we knew the person was cheating, we we're gonna confront it. I feel like of the three of us, the three best friends, the one that wasn't confronting the cheater, the other two would be like, film it. We want to see what her reaction is, film it hundred percent. I guess thinking of it from the perspective of the person that's been cheated on, why would you film it? Cause it's a very upsetting, you know, it's a moment where you're gonna, where you're gonna be very vulnerable and it's and it's emotional. You're gonna, like, why, why would you want to film that on the flip side? though i understand why the friends would be like i want to see her reaction if you go through we're done we're done okay. anthony stop dude bro give me my phone bro give me my phone anthony stop, what? stop bro chill bro, bro open the door open no. the door anthony open the door come on anthony stop are you really crying come over on. your phone dude anthony, open you're the really door. crying It makes you question, do people regret cheating after they do it or only when they're caught? You know what I mean? Like they say like, oh, like they're not sorry, they're only sorry they got caught. It seems like a lot of these situations, they're only upset when the person finds out, which I guess it's the case for a lot of cheaters. But from that perspective, it's like, then like it just doesn't make sense to me. You're with someone, you cheat on them on a regular basis and you, you don't feel any guilt until they find out knowing it hurts their feelings. Why not just leave them then? And I, like I've said before, I understand sometimes it's not that easy. Maybe you're married, you have kids, you this, you're that. Then still, you gotta mutually agree to break up. Okay, here I am right now. She's up here parked with this guy in this truck. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Huh? Uh, I'm showing you you're cheating on me. Huh? No. This is proof right here. She's cheating on me right now with this guy. I, su I subpoenaed, I subpoenaed your, uh, Text and your phone records too. Bye. See you later. I'm gonna call the police. Call the police. I don't know the full situation here. He said he subpoenaed her phone records and text messages. Maybe this is like a custody battle. Maybe. Look at the monkey. Ass. Look at the monkey. Ass. Oh, shout. Shout. You a cheeky shout. You fucking all shout. You fucking all shout. Damn. Oh, shout. I got you on Instagram. Shout. I know, here you go. Look at your phone too. You the cheek now, little hoe. 
Get your ass out of here. I think he just filmed everything and put it on Instagram with him throwing stuff out. Nice. Okay. Well, that's one way to go about it, I guess, right? To each their own. People have their own ways of dealing with cheaters. Some get angry. Some get back together with them. Some of them just do that. They just throw all their stuff out in front. And I, I kind of back it. I'm kind of like, you know what? Now you guys are kind of even. Not really, but kind of. So y'all, she just looked at me like hot. Hey, what's up? I see you looking at me. <laughs> Fine as hell. I Thanks. can tell by the mind. What's your name? Sabrina. Well, yeah, what's your number? Yeah, throw it in there real quick. Did you take her phone? No, no, I ain't take her phone. It's my phone, bro. That's your phone? No. It's my phone, fam. Don't be walking up on me like that. Go check your woman, fam. Don't She's be already been up checked. On now I'm letting you know. Have a good night. Fam, who? All right, you know what? You got it, bro. Yeah. You got it, fam. Y'all have a good night. And uh, talk to you later. I kind of wanted that camera to keep rolling. It like this guy was ready to drop the guy filming. I don't know. I feel like if I was the guy filming, you kind of want to tell the guy, like, listen, I know you're angry. Then again, the guy's kind of beat a dick about it. Like, I don't know. I get it because the guy, I don't ever understand why the guy is always quick just to blame the other guy. Usually the girls get mad at their boyfriends, is what I'm trying to say. The guys get mad at the other guys that are that are, are sleeping with said girlfriend. It seem, it doesn't make sense to me. It seems like the girls understand, like, I should be mad at the person with me, not the person that's just randomly hooking up with the person with me. And for some reason, guys are like, no, the person with me would never do that. It's the person they that sucked with that's who's to blame. And it's like, bro, I don't think so. But hey, to each their own. You call the cops. I got on camera. Yeah, she cheated. Got caught cheating. I'm caught cheating. This nigga's holding her hand. Get home. All right, I've been. Yo, man, I told you about this girl for years. Yo, explanation, man. Give her explanation. That's it. For, for the five years. Yo, you're an idiot, man. You're an idiot, man. And left it at her Good. Hey, Guess why? Why did I do that? Guess why? His suspicion was right. No, His suspicion was right. His suspicion was right. My brother took you off the street from Savannah, Georgia. And you do this to him for five years? Huh? Get the fuck out. Home. But you don't do that shit, people. Took your ass off the street. Your mama don't even watch you. Of course, it's out of Walmart, because we're of all other places, where could they do it but a Walmart, right? Jeez. Ah. I gotta go to Walmart when the pandemic's over and just, just people watch. It'll be a lot of fun. She's been getting hickeys from this. And I'm just finding out right now, but I want all YouTube to see this whole face. This is going on YouTube for all the guys who are talking to see, like, Vivian. Like this though, I would just leave. She lives in California. Like why are you, Ugh. unless you live together. I'm trying to get a face for you guys. What's your Facebook then? Hector, get the out of my face. What's your You're Facebook? in my house, get out. Like again, he's at her house. Again, maybe it's just I'm a different type of person, but like I, like I said, I, I if I found out my girlfriend was cheating on me, that would be history. It's like, yeah, I remember them. That happened a while ago. You don't speak to them? No, as far as I'm concerned, you know, they're, they, you know, they live on Mars now. No communication. I wouldn't know they even exist. Cause to me, cheating is like one of the ultimate disrespects. It's like a, the biggest slap in the face. Like it's just, I don't know. Who the f are you with? Who is that nigga? Who is he, bro? Who is he? You've been lying to me for too long. You don't know how to do kids on a snap map? Who is that nigga? Get out. Who the f is he, bro? Why is he running away? Like, who is he? No, bro, who the f man? You've been cheating on me for too long. I can't do this anymore. Can't do this anymore. Look at this yeah, that's a very weird situation. And the guy just ran away, which I, I mean, I don't know. He didn't seem like he was that big. This guy seemed very angry. I don't know. Maybe he just didn't want to fight. Maybe he was afraid. I don't really know. This guy didn't really seem that like he was going to beat anybody up. He just more or less was asking questions. He was a little angry, but I don't think he didn't necessarily throw hands. Maybe he would. I don't really know. Not my problem though, because I'm just reacting to the video. Oh, you poor little thing. You know what I got? I got my fucking mind. It's over between me and you. And I swear to Jesus Christ, may I love him to death. I'm leaving here in an hour. If you ain't in the program by Monday night, I'll never talk to you again as long as I live. My kids want me in their life. Our family needs us. Your mother's dying. Brittany's in prison. And you're out here sucking for a hit of oh. That was not a good situation, you guys. He was listing things off and I was like, that's Brittany's bad. Prison, that's also bad. Oh my gosh, it gets worse. I don't know when this was filmed, but I hope since then things have gotten significantly better for this man because uh, 
they were really not going very well. Really puts things in perspective, y'all. So I got an Instagram DM. Brad, help me, my girl's been flirting with other guys during quarantine. Can you do the loyalty test on her? And of course I said I'd do it. Your dad must have been a thief because he stole all the stars from the sky and put them in your eyes. Wow, plus 10 points for mentioning my eyes. Do I know you? You look familiar. And I'm thinking, oh no. So I say, I saw you on my explore page. Maybe you were just meant to have this conversation with me. And she said, well, you can't deny destiny. You're cute. What's your number? Wait, you're that guy from TikTok. How much can I pay you not to send this to my boyfriend? 25, 50? And <laughs> of course I sent it to the guy and didn't accept the money because you know, bro code. Wow, what? Wow. Plus 10 points for mentioning my eyes. Super generic and trill. Come on, that's everyone's go-to is to talk about the eyes. Hey, I really like your eyes. They're blue like blueberries. Can I touch them? Can I have them? I'm hungry. Also, $25 to not send to your boyfriend? That is low ballin', if you ask me. How much do you really care about this relationship? Obviously not very much. Let me talk to you. No, go away. Hey, What's up, bitch? Like my bitch. Let me talk to you. Go away. Let me talk to you. 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 Uh, what? <laughs> I felt like I was watching two separate people in the same person. Like that little like. Let, Let me talk, talk to, to you. you. And then just kicking and punching. Like, uh, pick a side. I don't know, that one was weird. I also don't think that tactic worked. That's what you doing, Brianna? For real? For real, Brianna, that's what you doing? I got, she got a whole <laughs> stay here and everything, bro. Man, again, she, you just being in <laughs> But this right here, she lying like a mother. So I had to get this what? What? No, go ahead. What the f you doing? You all that lying and sh bro. You gotta get up out of here, bro. 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 What the f is you doing though? What is you doing? What is you doing? My favorite part of that one was him walking into the apartment. He walked in with a vengeance. You could hear him stomping over. He wanted to make his presence known. Also, the bedside table stressed me out a little bit. Too much stuff. If you have a glass of water, where are you supposed to put it? That's just sad. So, are you and uh, Joe still together, Jen? What does that mean? What are you gonna do? What's up? Am I saying anything? You don't have to come over and start shit. I didn't. What are you cussing why, for? Why, I'm, not, I'm not cussing. You okay. Did you just... Well, I'm not making a scene. I'm just recording you and him together. I just had to get in my business. Oh, because you're married to my best friend. I saw your best really? Friend yeah. <laughs> really? He's like, yeah. That you are. Are you not? If you're going to cheat, which you shouldn't, but if you're going to cheat, why are you just doing it out in the open? You're just out of Walmart being like, I have a full marriage, but uh, who cares? Like, somebody's probably going to recognize you. Karma, hello. Hey, so uh, you didn't mean to hurt me? So then explain this. Explain this. Explain that. Explain that. Explain that. Explain that. Right? Explain that. Explain that. YouTube. Explain that. I didn't explain it. Figure it out. I was testing you. I was testing him. Oh yeah? You were testing him. Yeah, for real. Yeah, right. I find that hard to believe. Bando beast gang for life. See y'all. Okay. <laughs> okay. He said, "Explain that, YouTube." And I guess that's me. And like. I can't explain it. Also, her reaction to seeing those messages was the definition of instant regret. You know, we all saw that flash right across the screen in front of our eyes. Explain that. I was testing him. Explain that. I was testing him is probably the worst excuse I've heard on all five parts of these videos. And I haven't even been the host for all five parts, but I just feel like that one was the worst.
No. Oh my gosh. That's a nightmare. Do you know how embarrassing that would be to just run for the frisbee and then you're left alone in the desert? I know it's not a desert, but like in the desert? I do hope that she made her way home. I do hope that she's okay, but I also hope that she learned her lesson to not cheat on people because that's rude. Yeah, get the f out. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Get out. No. Go ahead. I'm calling the cops on you, bro. I'm calling the cops. Okay, you can't be mad at her for her job because she's allowed to make money in whatever way she wants to. But if she's messing around with his friends, I can see why there's an argument. You know what I mean? So like really her line of work is none of his business, but if she's cheating, that's something that we can all discuss and we can all say that that is rude. Say it with me now. That, that is, is rude. 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 We don't like rudeness here. Mm -mm. If I ever catch you around here again, I will rip your f***ing beard off, break it for- Get, get, Stop. get, 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 get. Stop. You think you got what's good? Hey, come you on. You think you got? You ain't here. Where's that energy now? What's up? Come on. You the f***ing. Go apologize to my son before I f***ing kill you out here. This is the reason mommy's not here right now. I want you to remember this face when you're older, so you can get your vengeance. No, no, I'm sorry. Why are you sorry? You broke my f***ing family up. <laughs> There's a lot to unpack with this one. <laughs> he started by threatening to rip his beard off. Not good. Great threat, 10 out of 10 threat. That would suck to get your beard just ripped off. The guy, though, also using the N word. Not a fan of that. I was on his side until that started happening, and I went, no thanks. And then, why is the kid involved? Leave the kid out of this. I want you to remember this face when you're older so you can get your vengeance. What in the Greek mythology is going on here? <gasps> oh! Great Odin's Raven. Because it's oh, ridiculous. Oh, Over it, just got caught cheating and shit. Wow. Better get all her shit. She better get all her shit and get out. Look at what the f you did. Yeah, look, I'm gonna show you what the f you did. I'm gonna show you what the f you did. Look. Why are people surprised when like their partner gets upset at them for cheating and is like, hey, I actually don't wanna share a bedroom with you anymore? Like, imagine if you had like bunk beds with a friend. Like you shared a room and then they betrayed you. You would be like, hey, I don't want to have bunk beds with you anymore. You know? Look at this. Look at this. They so fing loyal. They so loyal, right? This is loyal, right? This is loyal, right? This is her. This is loyal, right? This is her. This is loyal, right? Look at this. Boyfriend. Look at this. This is her. This is loyal, right? Ain't no loyal. Ain't no loyal. Caught in the car. Look what she got on. Dot. Dot. Look what she got on. Caught her. Caught her. Okay. I have absolutely no idea what's going on. And the only thing I could focus on is like that glitch that's in the video that made everything look weird. Like when she was walking away, I was like, what is going on? I, that's all I could focus on. I, it's somebody's ex-boyfriend in the car? I don't know, that's all I got from that, was that the video was weird and it was somebody's ex-boyfriend. So my girlfriend told me she's out with family and she forgot that I have her location and she's at this bar. So we're about to pull up on her and see what she's really doing. Hey babe, I thought you were out with family. Who's this? Hi, this is my girlfriend. Not anymore. <laughs> okay. Thanks, yeah. Oh, that was bad. Oh my gosh, the girl that she was out with absolutely okay. roasted her when she okay. didn't even deserve yeah. it. If you didn't know, that's one thing, but knowing and still doing it, you're not the most in the wrong, but you're definitely still in the wrong, you know? Don't hurt people's feelings. That's so rude. Anyway.
anyways, that's all the videos we have for today. We ended off on a strong one. One that I'm gonna be thinking about for at least the next hour. You know, memory of a goldfish, it's gonna leave eventually. Happy Valentine's Day, take off your blindfold, babe. Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Um, don't, don't, don't touch it, don't touch it. You still got a surprise. You still got a surprise. Oh, you're in for a surprise, alright. What? What's, what's in the back of the car? Uh, okay. Oh. Do you know what that is? So you're not cheating on me. I'm crazy. Babe, as if. Are you joking? No. And, and look right behind you. Oh my god, he's got the text messages too. See, those, those are your WhatsApp conversations. Oh. Yeah, it is Valentine's Day. My heart is broken. So go ahead and see the door, sweetheart. Oh. oh, she knows she's just been caught. The look on her face, she's like, oh, damn. But I will never understand why people feel the need to like film them exposing their partner for cheating. Like, couldn't you just like, you know, confront them on your own? Do you really need to film it? I wonder what they told her in order to convince her to hold up these cards. She told me she was pregnant. Oh, damn. We don't know who the father is. Oh, no. But we we're about to find out. Spill the tea, girl. What do you have to say? What do you have to say? Oh. Nah, yeah. Nah, yeah, you do. The people in the background are probably like, what is going on? There's a part of me that feels like it's staged, but part of me is also like, what if this is real? But I just, I feel like it has to be staged. You're holding up cards for so long. Like you have to convince this person to stand in front of a camera and hold up these cards. But this just feels so staged that I just, I don't know. I can't, I, I can't buy it. So my girlfriend left after seeing a fake text from her ex-boyfriend. Uh-oh. She even texted back saying she's going to see him now. Oh, no. Who is she on the phone to? Yeah, that's a really good question. Who are you calling, sis? What? Texted her saying that it was a joke. Oh. Follow for the confrontation. See, it's staged, it's so staged. Follow for the confrontation. Y'all, you know they wrote a script for this one. Uh-oh. As long as it's not one of those stupid card things. That's weird. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. This is the next time it's gonna happen. Okay. Okay, hold on. Um, do you remember these? All of our super, yeah. all of our super <laughs> cute messages that we have? Yeah. Cute. What are you doing? Okay. Yeah, they're so cute, right? Yeah. Hey, wait, Scott, Scotty, do you remember them? Oh. Hey! hey. Do, do you remember those? Wait. Wait, do you do you remember these though? What about all these other ones? Oh. Um. Yeah. Remember? The awkward sign. Hey, you can go have a go ahead and have a good day. Oh, you might want to keep these though. Here you go. Merry Christmas. Oh, oh. feisty. There was a reason I wasn't talking to her. Ah, I don't know. Did you guys hang out like two days ago? We hung out. Ah, once. Have a good one. Oh. Confrontation. Ooh. It's the 
fact that they took the time out of their day to print off the text messages and like they cut them out all nice on a square piece of paper, put them all together. They printed them in color, all right? You know they had a lot of time and extra change because they printed it in color and that's extra. If you're gonna confront somebody, especially for something like cheating that is like very serious, why are you putting more effort into it? Just cut them loose, say bye bye, sayonara, and then, you know, go on about your day. Do you guys wanna play Two Truths and a Lie? Yeah. Uh -oh. For TikTok? Yeah. Let's go first. Okay. okay. Um, I'm blonde. Okay. Um, <laughs> I used to play competitive basketball. <laughs> okay, obviously not. And um, <laughs> Victoria's been sleeping with my boyfriend. Are you kidding? What? But which one's up? You've been sleeping with my boyfriend. <laughs> I know. Can you turn the phone off? No. Matt, you've been kidding me? No. Turn the phone off. No. This isn't funny. Madison, turn the phone off. Stop. Ma oh my god. The fact that she did this for TikTok. I mean, these things do get the clicks, I will say. You know, they, they go viral. Clearly, because we're watching it right now. Who lost who out? Well, I did. <laughs> yeah, he did. Oh, uh, you did. Got my number, and then he was like, it took his time to text, actually. Yeah. But, yeah. Okay. That's so amazing. So, it looks like... I think like... we're almost... Yeah. yeah, we're right here. Okay, so is it next to this this blue Toyota, huh? Yeah, yeah. Uh -oh. yeah. Okay. How do I know that? Okay. How do I know so conveniently is this blue Toyota? Oh. Huh? This is my wife. Oh. Huh? What were you doing with this guy? Oh my huh? god. Yeah, we're married. We've been married for five years. You know what? Get out of the car. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting that. Go pack your bags because it's done. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Imagine it wasn't staged though. Imagine they just called an Uber and he just showed up out of the blue. Imagine, like, the universe really lined that thing up and was like, knocked that out of the park, and they did. Oh my god. Hey, princess. Oh, yeah. I'll ask you right now, will you marry me? Right really? now, really? you have to yes, answer yes, all yes. my questions and you can't say no. Okay, okay, okay. Is oh. your favorite color blue? Yes. Do you like the sky? Yes. Do you like dogs? Yes. Do you love me? Yes. Have you ever cheated on me? Yes. No, 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 please, I knew please, it. Please, no, please, I knew please, it. Please. I knew it. Every Look how cute she is sleeping. FaceTime gone wrong. Night, babe. Okay, baby, you could come over now. Oh my, oh my god. god, I knew it. Why are you on here, Phil? Stop. I knew it. Oh my god. The way she immediately jumped up was like, okay, baby, yeah, you can come over. <gasps> Dang, there's no taking that one back either. Y'all dating? Y'all a couple? Yeah, that's my boyfriend. Yeah, okay, okay. Does she have a boy best friend? Yeah. You do? I don't, yeah. I don't like him. Yeah, I, don't I don't like him at all. Uh, well, can you call him? I need you to call him real quick. Yeah. Just to, just say y'all broken up. Oh, she's and let's just see what he says. She's so nervous. Is that cool? Yeah. Uh, oh. Yeah, he, I mean, I'm pretty sure he wants you to do it anyways. I, she's but. so nervous. She knows that everything's about to end right now. Like she knows. Uh-oh. Hey, yo, what's good? Hi. Um, I'm just like really sad right now because like we broke up. Oh, you and your man's? Yeah. Uh, look, don't even stress about it. I'm gonna pull it right now. I'm gonna give you all the comfort you need. Bro, I told you. You're real good. Bro, I told you. Oh, oh. Wait, what's that? We're not broken oh, up. Don't even play with me. Oh, y'all not broken oh. up? No, you on that bullshit. I was already tapping there. What? Tapping <gasps> you said what? Oh, is this for real? Oh my god. Oh, oh, she looks so uncomfortable, but baby, you got yourself into that situation. You're the only one to blame. Oh my goodness. It kind of felt a little bit staged. But if he wasn't, if that was just like a fluke. A banana for my birthday. Amy. Come on, why do you have to do this all the time? It's annoying. It's my birthday. Just give me the present. So as I told you, okay? Mm -hmm. so oh my god, he's gonna be exposed. Cheating. 
on her birthday. <gasps> oh my gosh, the look on her face. Tell me what's going on. The look on her face. Who's he? Who's he? Who's he? Oh, you know exactly who's he. Nice, what's going on? Nice. What, what's going on? No, no, no this, nice. this is a joke. Huh? What, no, what joke? This is not a joke. This is not. But I've what, seen it's... the text. What text? Oh, Are no. you serious? What, what text? What text? That's not me. No, no. What's this? That's not me. That's not me. No, that's not you. That's not you. What the heck? Really? Oh, no. It's my birthday. You're ruining my birthday. I don't know why you came here, really, but I. I'm, this is so toxic, I'm out of here. That's so Bye. toxic. Like, you know what I'm saying? She this whole time. Yeah. The way she was like, oh. It's so toxic. You're the one cheating. I think that's the toxic behavior. She's definitely in the car. That's Kelly, your, right? Kelly's in there? Yeah, your girlfriend's in there. She's, she's calling that guy baby. So there's oh. that. Do you know him? Look at him. Do you know him? You know him? Tell me what's going on, buddy. This is your trainer. This is your trainer. Oh, God. Oh, no. I can't exactly give you a ticket for cheating on me with my girlfriend, but I can give you a ticket for speeding in a school zone. Hi, Kelly. Oh hey, no, no hey, no. hey, 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 hey. Ma'am, ma'am, get back in the car. I need you to get back in the car. Ma'am, get back in the oh car. You've done enough. You've done enough. It's a little too fake. It's a little too rehearsed. There's a script involved. I know it. As soon as they confronted her and she was like, oh my God, nobody's gonna. <laughs> no. <laughs> because it's oh ridiculous. Over it. Just got caught cheating and shit. Wow. Better get all her shit. She better get all her f***ing sh** and get out. Look at what the f*** you did. Yeah, look, I'ma show you what the f*** you did. I'ma show you what the f*** you did, look. Just not a good situation. Not a good, get out. You gotta go, cause this isn't gonna go well. You know what I mean? Can't me doing sh**, come outside. Where's she at, bro, she ain't here? I ain't, nah, I ain't no nothing with you, I ain't got no problem with you. Where the f***, where at? She ain't going nowhere, I just left. Man, you know what I'm on, bro. I ain't no s with you, bro. Where she at? Man, where she at? I drop her off, bro. Here, bro. Problem with me going in the room, but you ain't got no problem with standing here talking to me. Man, get the f out. She in there. You is or she is. That's the s you do. Man, I don't give a f about that. Hey, you know the difference between me and you? If I was in there with her, I would have made that come out. Yikes. So the girlfriend was cheating, but she's just like, won't come out of the room? Come on, if you're gonna be ballsy enough to cheat, you better be ballsy enough to face up to what you've done, you know? If I ever touch you around here again, I will rip your beard off, break it, get your shit, get shit. Stop. You think you got what's good? Hey, come you on. You think you got? You ain't, where's that energy now? What's up? Come on. You the Don't apologize to myself before I kill you out here. Go apologize to myself before I you up. I think we've seen another part of this one before where he was making him apologize to the kid. That poor kid needs to be left out of it. I want you to remember this face when you're older so you can get your vengeance. But this one, because I remember when he said, I'm gonna rip your beard off and I was like, ow. <laughs> like, yeah, you can be upset that this man was ruining your marriage, but uh, don't use the N word. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, I'm gonna go hang out with the boys. Do you wanna come with? Uh, no, I'm gonna hang out with the girls today. Hey, I'm gonna go hang out with the boys right now. Alright, have fun. Alright, so my girl's been acting super weird, super weird. Every time we hang out, she's always on her phone texting other people. I don't know who it is. So I'm gonna hide out. I'm not actually going to hang out with my boys. I'm gonna hide out and I'm gonna catch her. Who the fuck is this guy? Was that real? Oh, boy. Hey, I'm gonna go hang out with the boys right now. That's what I call Oscar award winning movie. Ooh, that's bad. That's bad news bears, you guys. Uh-uh. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. What would you even do? Ugh, and you're in the hot tub too. 
Dang it. <laughs> he didn't. Where is he going? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Where is he going? <laughs> Keyshawn, what are you doing? What the f are you doing? What are you Who's doing? Who's in there? Hey, who's in there? Nobody's here. Keyshawn, you're tripping. Who's in the house? Did you lose this pipe from all the way down there? Wait, who's in there? <laughs> okay, I think that I saw this on TikTok or something. And I don't think that anyone was actually in the house. I think that she was just playing a prank on him to make him think. That somebody was like coming over or whatever. That's so funny. His face <laughs> up against the screen. Oh, uh, savage. Oh, man. That would be so embarrassing. And why does it look like they're in the desert? The middle of the de- Well, other than the trees that are behind him. But, <laughs> but like... Where is this? Why is that beach on a hill? I got a lot of questions. What? You've never been giving me no love and affection or attention. Man, what you mean, Patty? I give you my heart and his money. Fuck the hell with me, Patty. Nah, I ain't talk about it. Hey, real talk. Get out, man. You trying to get aggressive with me? No, I'm like, keep that stupid out. Come on, bro. Let me one more time. Yo, real talk. his now ex girlfriend that's the one question i have there's a lot going on in this situation but i have to understand why somebody else was involved for seemingly absolutely no reason you've never been giving me no love and affection or attention Drop this nose. so uh you didn't mean to hurt me so then explain this explain this Explain that. I was explain you. that. I was explain that. You. Explain that. Right? Explain that. Sh explain that. Sh YouTube. Explain that. I didn't figure it out. I was testing him. Oh yeah, you were testing him. Yeah, for real. Yeah, right. I find that hard to believe. Bando Beast Gang for life. See y'all. <laughs> I'm so sorry for laughing. I didn't figure it out. Wait. I'll make up a lie. I was testing him. Um, testing him for what? Why are you testing anybody? Isn't that supposed to be the other way around? You failed. You failed that test. I'll tell you that for sure. <laughs> Congratulations. You played yourself. <laughs> happened <laughs> I'm literally speechless <laughs> that would be uncomfortable for everyone involved I've felt awkward and I'm sitting in my own bedroom you know what I mean I, mm -mm, I'm glad I wasn't there it was a f***ing joke dude I didn't mean you actually go f*** my dad what the f***? why would anyone do that? I don't know. He's <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Holy. Hey, that one really went off. First of all, 45 is very young to have a daughter her age. So good for him, I guess. High five. No, I take that back. I take that back. I take that back. I didn't mean that. I really didn't mean that. Um, that's wild. Ew. Taking my girlfriend's phone while she's in the shower. What are you doing? What? The 
Crocs. Wow. Wow. <laughs> That's not a good sign. No cheating was confirmed. But, you know. But you applied it, and that's good enough. Very suspicious that you would be that concerned over your phone. You know? No accusations. I'm just saying. Suspicions have been raised. <laughs> this is why you come to Miami! This is why you come to Miami! Yeah, this is what? Yeah. Yeah. What? Yeah. 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 <laughs> the person that just came in the, in the door. Oh my god, he's so mad. Come inside. As anyone would be. He's not leaving you, you're not leaving either. This guy is so unimpressed. <laughs> oh my god, there's so much drama. And I'm guessing like the guy is like the hotel worker person. And he's just so unimpressed. He's like, y'all acting a fool in the middle of the hallway. Honestly, I feel like that's something to, you expect when you go to a hotel. Like somebody's gonna be yelling or some child's gonna be running up and down the halls. It's it's part of the atmosphere, really. So my girlfriend told me she's out with family uh, and she forgot that I have her location and she's at this bar. Uh -oh. So we're about to pull up on her and see what, what she's doing. What if she's really at the bar with your family? Yeah. Probably isn't. Really? Are you joking right now? I don't know. Hey babe, I thought you were out with family. Oh. Who's this? Hi, this is my girlfriend. Not anymore. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. Oh. The clap back. <gasps> she said not anymore. Oh my God. Girl, the shade, the shade of it all. When she got caught, she didn't even look phased by it. She was probably like, eh, who's bound to happen sooner or later? Like, what? Like, save everybody the trouble. You don't have to do that. You don't have to take the long way out. That's just weird. There's no way she's going to find this camera. Oh I oh. left the house and literally parked down the street I don't like to this try. Is toxic. Why are you spying on I people? I recorded the live stream on my phone until this happened. Oh god. Oh god. What was that? It was your demise. Your doom. Who TF <sighs> is that? Oh, you of have course. To be they're me. Perfectly in the shot. Complete too. waste of 6 plus years of my life. Thanks, Ashley. Okay, I sincerely hope that this is fake. I hope that people aren't really going out and buying those like secret camera things and spying on people, trying to find something. If you have a hunch that your partner is cheating on you, confront them. You don't need to buy a secret camera and plug it into the wall and hope for the best. Like, just talk, talk it out. Keep calling my phone. My ex called Shorty, I'm not lying on shit, bro. Why would you keep okay. calling my phone, though, bro? So where's the receipt that bro, um, can you please stop calling my phone, bro? No, what you, you blocked. You blocked, bro. You're blocked. Not you're, not blocked. Not you're blocked. That's so toxic. You're blocked. You're, no, bro, you're blocked. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, the toxic energy. I don't even know what to say about that. It's just toxic, point blank period. It's toxic. Can you hear something funny? Always. So oh, the other shoot. night, I was um, <laughs> checking your location uh -oh. and uh -oh. Um, uh -oh. it said that you were uh -oh. at my boyfriend's house at uh -oh. 3 a.m. Oh, why are you uh -oh. checking my location? Oh, my like <laughs> Well, one, what? you are my friend, and um, you are at my boyfriend's house. I mean, I don't know. She knows about I don't know. it. No, no, She's no, like, don't no. drag me into this. I mean, the thing is, like, no, no, this if is you were satisfied with me, you would have to come to me. Like, I don't even, like, I don't, like, I don't oh. what? Ah, I mean, like, okay, okay. so. so oh, I'm shaking. Oh, that is, I forgot your name already. I don't know you. Oh, my God. If you were satisfying him, he wouldn't have had to come to me. Are you kidding? You're blaming this on her? What? What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. 
On the bright side, her shirt looks fantastic. I love the little beads on it. That's really cute. I mean, she's gonna be able to hit the town and find a new boyfriend that isn't as toxic as that other one. Honestly, they can, you know, those two can just be a, a, a pair since they both want to stab people in the back and act a mess. Babe, I cheated on you last night. Oh my God. <gasps> Not Wait, what? I said, babe, I cheated on you last night. I know, I'm saying, was it good? No, <laughs> I didn't cheat on a diet. I cheated on you last night. Yeah. Yeah. She's just not faced. He's like, what? <laughs> well, I didn't really cheat, but since now I know it's okay, I guess I can go do it today, right? Sure, go ahead. <gasps> She's like, wait a minute. Something's not right. <laughs> Who are you cheating on me with? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, wow, the tables have turned. Well, well, well. How the turntables. Nobody's just like, okay with that. No one's like, oh, you cheated? Oh, good for you. Was it good? Yeah? You had fun? Cool. Huh? Something else had to have been happening. You don't just roll up and be like, I cheated on you, and the other person's like, Oh, that's nice, dear. My two truths and a lie. So, uh -oh. oh, wait, no. Oh, oh, the confrontation. So, one, my name's Kate. Yes. Two, yep. I'm committed to two for football. <laughs> and mm -hmm. three, you've been sleeping with my boyfriend. <sighs> yeah. I know. <laughs> wait, what? Oh. No, 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 no. Keep it on. Uh, wait, 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 wait. wait. Yeah. I want to believe that this is a real confrontation. There's been so many of them that are like so obviously staged. But like, the, come on, the two truths one lie. Like, my middle name is Kate, and I am some whatever the middle one was. And then you're sleeping with my boyfriend. Like, okay, all right. I'm calling bullshit. Can we come up with like something else, like a little more creative, right? I'm all here for the confrontation. The confrontation brings the spice, the drama, the tea, and all the things we love. But come on, two truths and a lie. Lame. Okay, we're playing Never Ever Ever. Oh god, here we go. Never Have Ever, Two Truths, One Lie. Never Have I Ever Made Out With My Friend's Boyfriend. Oh, right right off the bat, okay. You better put that finger down. Okay, but he was flirting with me first. You're my friend, you shouldn't do that anyways. But just get out of the- There's no coming back from that one, man. Right off the bat, just Never Have I Ever Kissed Somebody- I don't remember what, exactly what she said, but you know what I'm talking about. Okay, we're playing Never Ever Ever. Okay, Never Have I Ever Broken a Bone. Never Have I Ever Made Out With My Friends. <laughs> Once she realized that she was caught, it was, oh, that, that's priceless. She's like, but like, you flirted with me first. Okay, yeah. So, you're supposed to be a good friend. You're supposed to say, no, that's bad. And then you go and tell your friend, hey, so-and-so was trying to flirt with me. Because then, you're going to save your friend the heartbreak. Yo, Lana. So, uh -oh. um, what happened? Oh. Why, are you guys, why are you playing both of us? Telling us the same exact oh. thing, Alana. Why? Why oh, are you both in on it. Alana, this isn't right. Oh. You're telling us the same exact thing. You were with me last night, weren't you? We had sex last night, didn't we? We did? We did? Uh, we did? Um, I think we should probably uh, remember that, but... Yikes! I like how the guy in the passenger seat is just not saying a single thing. He's just letting the other guy handle it. He's like, I was here because I was promised snacks or something, you know? I'm here for the drama. I don't really care. <laughs> I feel like that's the energy that's going on there. Again, with these kinds of videos, I never know if they're real or fake because like, they seem too good to be true. You know what I mean? I feel like maybe that one's real. Who knows? Who cares? It happened. It's funny. Uh -oh. Never have I ever... <gasps> Went to Chick Fil A. Never have ever uh, Carly's boyfriend. Oh, I haven't done that. I did. I haven't done. We both. And we told you. You Savion. You The tea. Hey, at least I kept my fingers up, except for me going to Chick Fil A. The lemonade is really good. Anyway, again, I just I can't get past the whole like put a finger down, two truths, one lie thing. You know? You know what? Let's brainstorm. One day we're gonna we're gonna brainstorm a bunch of different ideas on how to confront somebody about cheating on somebody else. Cause this is getting a little. Also, a little, a little. 
Come again? Emma. Yeah. I have something to tell you. Uh oh. So Break like yourself, Emma. this weekend. No, I think you should stay. Oh no, yeah, definitely. This weekend I saw Derek and Kelly hooking up. <gasps> I saw them hooking up. I walked in on them hooking up. They were hooking up? <gasps> Are you fing kidding me? That's a joke, right? I don't think she's kidding. Oh my god, they were hooking up. Oh my oh, god, they, they were roommates. roommates. Man, I feel like that is kind of staged. Just a wee bit. Just, I don't know. Like, nobody's sitting on the bed just casually, like, not doing anything, and then someone pulls out a phone. Like, I need, I have something to tell you. No one communicates like that. Things don't happen like that. I don't know. Something's not right about that. Oh, rough, man. Rough. Gonna do my intro, because uh, you're married. Um, so yeah, I think I lost my train of thought, but I'm gonna do number five now. Three, two, one. Part five, an instant regret. All right, I'm ready. I think that's the part I would be the most heated about. Not even that they were flirting with somebody else, but that they thought our relationship was only worth $25. Come on. Like, let alone sharing an actual bed. Like, I don't want there to even be a possibility of your hand grazing mine while I'm trying to get my eight hours. You know what I mean? All right. <clears throat> but dang. The way they're waving goodbye. I'm dead. Oh my God. <gasps> Oh my god, clearly my brain isn't here all today. The day that this is going up, it's going up on July 22nd, which will be my 25th birthday. Isn't that exciting? Hmm, a lot of contentious situations happening over here. Ooh, also, you wanna see another one of my plants? This is another one of my plants. I don't know what kind of plant it is. Um, she doesn't have a name because I couldn't think of a name that I liked. Um, and she's like growing like another like, can you see this? Another like green leaf all the way over here. I'm kind of like, what's going on with that? Anyways, back to the clips. Whatever, we'll just do it. We'll just do it. F*** it, we'll do it live, you know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> These outros get weirder and weirder every-